Okay, hi everyone. Welcome to my crazy crafty life. Today, this video is sponsored by Chongers. So thank you so much for this opportunity. I am so grateful to have this chance at showing you this wonderful interactive pet. I think these are awesome, especially if you love animals like I do and have allergies like I do. <laughs> but they're also great for all kinds of purposes and people. So this is what this looks like. This is the cute little box it comes in. How cute is that? That is really cute. I love it. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Here is the box open. There is our little friend. <laughs> There's little paw prints all in the inside. I'm going to pull this kitty cat out. So Percy Companion, it's the type of cat. Ah, oh, you're sweet. So this is what she looks like when she comes out of the box. How cute. She's got a little tag here. She feels nice. She feels like a real kitty. The next thing in this box, the last thing in this box is this little piece here. So it says, I'm going to read everything in here just because of all of the things that we need to know about her before we do anything. So I'm going to take out this card. I'm going to show you the, she comes with a little charger so you can charge her and a little comb so you can comb her because she's brand new. She might need a little bit of brushing. That's relaxed. That, I can see how that can be relaxing and calming, especially if you have anxiety like I do. So that's really nice. I like that. All right, let's put it here. And then I'm going to take out this. Everything came nicely packaged. She came nice and safe. I'm going to put the comb and the charger back in here. This is the instructions it says. Percy Interactive Companion Pets. I thought the Percy doll, I thought the yeah, rag doll was a different name, but I guess not. I guess we can rename her if we want to. Uh, if you have any suggestions. <laughs> All right, so... It gives you all of this, and I'm going to have to read on how to do all of this so I can show it to you guys. There is also all of this. And then there's this cute little um, intro thing. There's this letter, so I'm going to read that. <clears throat> Dear Delia, <laughs> by the time you read this letter, we are ge geographically far apart, but our products bring us so close together. We thank you very sincerely for your trust, which is the greatest recognition of our work. We are still a very small company, but are willing to provide the best service to our customers every time. Our products are so full of warmth and love. We want to make sure that our service is too. You can t contact us through our email, it's support at chongers.com. Our customer service staff will respond to your question quickly within 12 hours and give you a solution in the first reply. Also, we very much welcome our customers to participate in production, in our production. There are very many of them give us a persistent and growth oriented suggestions. You can send us a picture of the stuffed animal you would like to see, as well as a reference, and we will consider your suggestion carefully. 
And if it is adopted, we will inform you and invite you to name this stuffed animal created by you. We And we will introduce this nice story on our customer wall for our and our pro product page. Finally, Chonker is still small, but we still we have the best customers in the world. Your tolerance and trust inspire us to keep growing, and we sincerely thank everyone who reads this letter from all of us at Chonkers. And it even has everybody's names and signature there. Uh, that's cute. So it says, please note, with the long distance and transportation, the hair will be messy. Shake the pet. Slap off the floating hair. It actually says that. <laughs> And then mission complete. Well done. Comb the hair. Okay. So it says shake the pet. That seems wrong. No, we don't want to shake the baby. But let's, yeah, there's some hair flying off. Okay. So I guess it's just to get the, it says, look, slap off the floating hair. Okay. Sorry. I didn't mean it. <laughs> I love you. <laughs> We're being ridiculous. It's okay. Um, all right, so, and then comb the hair, which I did a little bit of. And then they send you this, pictures of other pets that they have. This is the one that I got. I love rag, rag doll cats, so. And the blue eyes, oh my gosh, the blue eyes. <laughs> I love it. I'm gonna comb you. Comb you. All right. Now we got to figure out how to, okay. So the charging port is kind of hidden right here and it's in her fur right there. So that's where you charge it. Is that where you turn it on? Yep. <laughs> hi, hi, hi. So she does meow. She purrs. Can you hear that? I hope you can hear that. Hold on. My microphone's over here. Can you purr for us? Baby, can you purr? There we go. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. Hi. All right, so <laughs> she's adorable. I love her. I need a name. Yes, I know. And she meows. <laughs> Let's see. So it says, oh, two times feel the heartbeat. And then it says, so this has like all kinds of buttons in the paws. You can hear a heartbeat, you can pat the back. There's of oh, the chest. There's an automatic sleep function for more than 10 minutes. Um, Part C will automatically enter the sleep function. Touch or use again will wake up again. Um, uses a, a C charging and it shows you how to figure out if it's fully charged or not. Okay, so Percy and I have spent the last couple of days getting to know each other and um, I wanted to show you all of the features now that I really know how to use her and go over all of that. So right here in her little back leg there is a velcro compartment where the charger lives and you can i can show you right here it does have a little light too i think that indicates whether it's charging or not once you're done with it you can tuck it right back in her leg and i think there's velcro do i feel the velcro there's supposed to be a snap or a Velcro. I feel like there's a snap here, actually. Yeah, I think that's what the, what's in here. 
But anyways, you can close it up enough that you won't see it. See? It's just like a little seam and it's it's pretty hidden once you have her perched on something. So okay and then on the same leg her her little paw here to turn her on i'm having a hard time holding you <laughs> she has waited um press down the button and that turns her on and then this button here voice mute mutes her voice on or turns her on so you can either mute her or not um then this one is the volume you can turn it up or down I'm going to turn it up. So you just keep pressing it until you like where it where it's at. And then voice mute. I'm going to mute her for a second cuz I want to see. So if you want to make her if you want to hear her heartbeat, you just put your arm here. I don't know if you can hear that. I hope you can. And then if you pat her, she'll purr. Yeah, I know. Okay, I'm gonna put her voice back on. So I'm gonna voice on. Press that, and then we're gonna talk. Meow. Yeah, Meow. I know. We're gonna have a little conversation. So there's three commands that make her talk. So you say meow meow. meow. You can say. Hello, Percy, and rise and shine. I also want to show you because I am thinking of changing her name, so I I just tried it to see if it would work. So I said, he hello, baby. Hello, baby. She will meow. Maybe not every time, but she will. <laughs> hello, princess. Hello, princess. She also has a sensor in her tail. I can feel it. It's near the base. So what do you do when I touch the tail? I'm not exactly sure. I think she'll talk. Yeah, she talks. Okay. And then you can touch her head. If you pet her head, she'll meow. And her chest right here. She'll purr for you. <laughs> she loves it. She loves her little scratches. And I think this is awesome, especially if you have anxiety. I have anxiety. I've dealt with it for a very long time. And it is really nice to just have the little purring sensation. I'm very allergic to cats, so I cannot have a real cat. <laughs> Even having a dog is difficult because if they're hypoallergenic and they go outside, they usually track in things that I'm allergic to, like pollen and and grass and all that stuff. So I definitely have a lot of trouble with pets. But this little girl so far has been great. Oh, I hear her heartbeat. Yeah. Yeah, so just I mean it's it's a fun little a fun little kitty to play with and hold and especially if you are dealing with issues and um, s problems in your life and you just need something to kind of calm you down. It also has, so for the battery charge, see the light that I was talking about? There's a green and a red, excuse you, I'm talking. <laughs> so the green says full of electricity, so it's fully charged, and the red is charging status, so it'll light up red letting you know that it is charging. So that's nice. And then I have some talking points and I will show you some, oh, let's turn you off. Yes, let's turn you off, I'm sorry. <laughs> I know, that's what she sounds like when she sh turns off. And then I have some talking points. So I have my phone here <laughs> for those. So uh, for chonkers, it's good for elderly, especially people with dementia and Alzheimer's disease, and children. It has a variety of interaction functions, meets the needs of a pet companion, provide comfort and joy of a real cat companion, 
no need for special care or feeding, especially if you do have an elder, elderly person who may forget or a child who may forget and you just want to test out and see what they'll do with the cat if they'll actually take care of the cat, groom the cat, play with the cat, um, you know, maybe even pretend feed the cat. You could, you know, see how they do with that and that would be great. Uh, reduces the cost and time free from cat bites and clot and injuries, especially elderly and children. They can be especially sensitive to those things. Also too, sometimes children can be a little rough and the cat may lash out because the child isn't, you know, being too nice. So you can definitely test it out with the pet and make sure that they're going to be gentle and sweet to the little cat. And um, it's a pet assisted therapy tool they can help people with dementia and Alzheimer's find calm in moments of stress, overwhelm, and other big emotions. So for, and then, yeah, so there's that. Okay, I think that was everything I needed to tell you. <laughs> so I think it's a good, um, I think it's a good cat for everyone that, uh, you know, has either elderly or children that they want to see if how they do and see if it helps them. And also if you have anxiety, like I do, <laughs> um, I know I did, I touched on that, but I really do have a lot of anxiety. I actually have to take medicine for it. And it's not something I really talk about on my channel. I keep, like to keep things light and fun, but for someone like me, I can definitely see how this could be a nice relaxing little thing. I mean, there have been studies that show having a pet is uh, beneficial to most people, especially if you have an anxiety issue. Um, so yeah, I really like this little kitty. I've always wanted a ragdoll cat and I think she's absolutely precious. And <laughs> I, uh, I am excited to have her in my life. I was actually considering buying one of these. Like I don't show things unless I think it's something I would personally purchase for myself or someone I love. So I really did. I had the page open on my browser and I had it saved so that I could maybe think about investing in one. So I mean honestly I think it's just as good as they say. I've seen others um, show these and yeah it's it's a beautiful little pet it's very realistic I mean the hair you know it may not be like a real cat hair but it's definitely realistic so I think for anyone who wants a little kitty in their life and maybe can't maybe you live in an apartment and you can't have a cat right now this would also be a very great little thing there are tags in here that show you that it is a real chonkers pet and the tail is just so fluffy and cute. I love this thing. So anyways, that is it for this little girl here. I'm calling her a girl. I think she could be either or whatever you want, but I think she looks like a little girl, so I'm gonna keep it as a girl. <laughs> She's got her little whiskers. Look at that, that's so cute. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed this. There are links and uh, if there's a discount code too, it'll be in the description box. I'm pretty sure there is. Um, but if you need anything from me, have any questions, please let me know and I'll try to answer them the best that I can. I love and appreciate each and every one of you. Thank you so much for watching. And if you would do me a huge favor and just click on the link and take a look at what they have, um, that would be huge because it'll let them know that you watched my video and you liked my video and that you wanna help support the channel by checking out what they have and letting them know that, you know, people are actually watching this video and interacting and, and taking a look at what they have. So that would be really awesome if you do that. And yeah, like I said, I love and appreciate each and every one of you. So thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye guys. <coughs> Say bye bye. Percy. Hello, Percy. <coughs> bye bye, Percy. <laughs> Can you say bye? No, you don't want to say bye.
okay. 